So for this part, I want to show you how you can use the specific call citation function with the Bibliometrics package. Now the reason why we're making a separate video on this is because most other Bibliometrics softwares uh, have limited call citation analysis functions. And therefore, we believe that we can use our Bibliometrics to show you how to do call citation analysis. So if you are a bit familiar with the Bibliometrics package already, um, you should look into the function which is called um, Bibliometric Network Function uh, because this is where you can adjust the type of analysis you want to do. And if you want to find out exactly what, what type of analysis you can do, uh, you need to look, um, you need to get the help file for your package. It's simply by clicking, clicking the name of the package and it will open the help uh, site for you inside our studio and you see that these are all help pages for the specific commands and if you click now on biblio uh, network help page it will explain to you the codes and the different types of uh, lines you can put in and you see that for analysis we can use collaboration coupling core occurrences or co-citation but the default is coupling and they even give you some examples on how to use a co-citation analysis so um so please uh go to the code and start uh, adjusting so you want the co-citation um you go and write co-citation by the analysis type we want to look at references so type in network equals references and you should have your command click run or control enter and now you need to decide how you want to plot this. So if you now try to use the default, you will notice that the title is set to Auris Coupling, the type is Fruchtemann, etc. So uh, you can always adjust the title by yourself, simply the name of the plot. So we can call this Code Citation of References. Uh, then you can click uh, Run, and you'll see that it gives, you, it gives us a uh, Code Citation of References. But with this, uh, you notice that they are separate from each other. It's because it's been set to running the type, Fruchtemann analysis type. Um, if you now go to the help page for the plot function, which is network plot, uh, you see that there's a, there's a bunch of uh, additional adjustments we can do. But let's look at the type. Uh, we see that we can put circle, sphere, MDS, or multi-dimensional scaling, Kamada, or even Voss viewer. But this function is still under development, I believe. So you can play around and see what are the types you want to use. So let's just start from the top. We can use the circle. And see now, these are all oriented in a circle. Can kind of try to make connections to them and see which one are most co sided with each other. Uh, by instance, um, it is kind of expected to see early and Thomas co sided together because they each represent a definition of cultural intelligence, but they are distinctive. Um, but yeah, so you can get a lot of information from seeing what are the most co sided references. You can always adjust to how many you want to see. So we see that there's a function for n, and it's set to 20. But if I'm interested in the most 100, we can do so as well. It's a bit less uh, noisy, but you see you get the idea. You can always adjust um, to your own preference how, how much you want to see. And this is how you can do the co-citation analysis with the Bibliometrics uh, package. So I hope I hope you enjoyed this video and um, please uh, follow us if you want to see more tutorials or even leave a comment on which one you want to see specifically and we'll make a video for you. Thank you.